Hey YouTube, it's your boy Dark Queasy Gaming, and welcome back to our Pokemon Emerald Randomized Nuzlocke. This is episode 4. Last episode, um, not much happened. We made our way to the forest, um, and we battled the first Team Aqua Grunt. But yeah, we've explored um, a couple of new routes. Um, I didn't catch anything new. But with that being said, let's get into the team recap. So starting off, we have our starter, the Aeron named Queen, a still rock type with a sturdy ability, timid nature. Its moves are tackle, harden, mudslap, and headbutt. It just learned headbutt and mudslap in the previous episodes. Then next up, we have Venonat that we named um, Mothy. With, that is a bug, poison, Pokemon with the shield dust ability, the docile nature. Um, with Tackle, Disable, Foresight, and Supersonic. And not gonna lie, Mothy is coming pretty clutch. Um, helping us out during these beginning routes. Cause, um, yeah, Aeron was not gonna make it. Well, not Aeron, uh, Queen. And was not gonna make that. So, let's start off by going back to the Pokemon Center while we're, while we're, uh, pretty close. Make it easier. Heal up. And then, continue on through the woods. So... There are many types of Pokémon. All types have their strengths and weaknesses against other types. Depending on the types of Pokémon, a battle could be easy or hard. For example, your Torchic is a fire type. It's strong against the grass and bug types, but it's weak against water type Pokémon. Water and rock. That PC-based Pokemon storage system, whoever made it must be some kind of scientific wizard. I don't have a Torchic lady. When my Pokemon ate an Orenberry, it regained HP. Hello there, trainer. You've got a wonderful smile there. I have a hobby, collecting the profiles of Pokemon trainers. So how about it? May I see your profile? Sure. Yes, thank you. So let's see it then. Oh, I don't want to do this. Oh, you're not into it right now? Well, any time is good by me. I don't want to do it ever. Okay. That out of the way. Let's go back. Okay, cool. No encounter. Some scary, scary fucking Pokemon right here. I'm not gonna lie. It's like legends and shit. All right. Okay, now we're basically back where we just were. So now, let's continue forward. Fight me! Yo there, your Pokemon doing okay? If your Pokemon are weak and you want to avoid battles, you should stay out of the tall grass. Thanks, bud. Fight me! If you take bug Pokemon to school, you get to be instantly popular. I don't think that's realistic, brother. Oh, a Cubone. Hey, but you. And then headbutt you. Bye bye. Far fetched. Headbutt. And headbutt. Haven't seen any normal Pokemon for a minute. I've only been fighting legendaries and stuff. I can't be popular if I lose. Ooh, an item. What is it? Garbage. That would have been tight if I could have caught you. Don't want to use 
up all my headbuds. Oh, good lord. Oh, you dig. Nope, I'm not letting you do that. Fuck. Anything to bump off. Please unthaw. What's up here? Route 104. Is this? Check something. Item. So yeah, this is a continuation of Route 104, so no new encounter yet. Ooh, a blue scarf? What does that do? Let me see what the blue scarf does. Oh, beauty. Beauty contest shit. I don't want that. Okay. Damn it. Almost made it. Yep, so this is... No new encounters on this route. It's a continuation of Route 104. Fuck. Hey, cut that shit out, the trio. Woo. Get me out of there. Pretty petal flower shop. Let's get these orange berries. We'll take what we can get. Cherry berries. Let's get it. What do cherry berries do? Paralysis poisoning. <sighs> Mothy, I guess you're gonna have to take over for a little bit. Um... No, you know what? Fuck that. Fuck that. I'm just gonna go back and heal. Oh, I hate it. I hate it so much, but I gotta do it. Fuck. No, not through the grass, idiot. <sighs> Welcome back to Petalburg City. <laughs> Alright, go through here. Because I don't want to deal with that. Who knows what kind of Pokemon those trainers have up ahead on the rest of Route 104. I'm not going to deal with that. I'm not going to deal with that shit. 
Oops. Stop, 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 stop. Okay. <sighs> Alright. Mm, we can switch. Queen, you can get back to the... Fr mm, no, let's let Moppy shine for a little bit. Catch up. Okay. Damn, it would be the first patch of grass. Get out of the way. Fuck. Oh my god, they got dittos here? That's pretty cool. Yo, a ditto would be pretty sweet in a Nuzlocke. Loki. Just a little bit. I'm gonna ignore you, well rain. Alright. Now nah, we're back to where we were. <sighs> That's okay. What do you have to say, boy? I like filling my mouth with seeds, then spitting them out fast. I like you, so you can have this. Use it on a Pokemon and it will learn Octazooka. What does that have to do with firing seeds? Well, nothing. Okay. Fight me. Oh, sure. I'll accept your challenge. I have a lot of money. Ooh, thank you, bud. That's a lot of money I'm gonna have. Oh, good lord. Um, supersonic. Such a bad trainer. Why do you have a fully evolved <laughs> Trico at level seven? You suck. It's only gonna know Trico's move set. Fucking trash. Oh, because you're one of those rich trainers. You're gonna use a full restore. You're a bitch. Bitch too, bruh. Idiot. Train up better, bro. Why couldn't I win? Because you fully evolved your Trico at level 7. You cheated, basically. Idiot. Alright, it's enough from you, Moth. Oh boy. Should I or shouldn't I? Okay, sure, I will battle. Oh, good lord, Electabuzz? Ha! There's not much you can do against me, brother. We are gonna mud slap you. Good lord. Damn, I thought I was a ground type for a minute. Rock steel.
block you. You might die here, Mafia, I'm sorry. Okay. Tackle. Oh, fucking asshole. Tackle! Oh. Black Buzz was a threat for a minute. Oh, you fucker. Wobbuffet? Sure. stuff. Fuck your veil. Oh, you dick. Oh my god! No! Wobbuffet is sick, dude. Oh my god. That shit sucks. Fuck you, Wobbuffet, you fucking bastard. Uh, I shouldn't have battled. Fuck off. Fuck you and your Wobbuffet. I already have a death and I'm not even... I haven't even been the gym leader yet or anything. Fuck off. Oh my fucking shit. This is not... This is not good. Mothy, no. Thank you for having mercy. Thank you. Give me these fucking berries. growing in, in loamy soil, feel free to take them, but make sure you plant a berry in the same spot. That's common courtesy. Here, I'll share this with you. Chesto berry. The way you look, you must be a trainer, no? Trainers often make Pokemon hold berries. It's up to you whether to grow berries or to use them. Oh, let's give you an orange berry. Rustboro City. Item. A dire hit? Fuck that shit. We are in Rustboro City. We're still in. Okay. Can I go through here? Is there anything? Nothing? Okay. Let's check this building. Devon Corporation's workers live in this building. Do they now? The floors are here. My daddy's working at the corporation. My daddy made this, but I can't use it, so you can have it. Oh, a premiere ball? That's pretty cool. Way back in the old days, Devon was just a teeny tiny company. Oh yeah? Tell me more. Man. This is like the president right here. 
Devon's president likes to collect rare stones. I think the president's son also collects rare stones. I'm talking about mega stones? Steven? Pokemon gains experience in battles. It can sometimes change in the way it looks. Pokemon changes shape? If one did that, I would be shocked. Yep. Well, while we're here, let's, uh... <sighs> let's heal up. And then we are going to drop off Moffy into the PC. Into the RIP position. Sadness, sadness, sadness. Pause it. Authy, I'm sorry. Box one. And then while we're at it, let's name this to RIP. Moffy, you will be missed. Damn, that shit sucks, man. I was mad. The man next door gave me an HM. I used it to teach my Pokemon how to cut down skinny trees. My Pokemon has a naive nature, and my friend's has a jolly nature. It's fantastic how Pokemon have personalities. Yeah. Just like people, they are there are male and female Pokemon, but no one seems to have any idea how they're different. Have you looked at their tails, brother? Have you looked at their tails? Oh, who might you be? You're a new face around these parts. Have you just transferred into the Pokemon Trainer School? Shut up, bitch. I challenged the gym leader, but it's not going to be easy winning with my Fire-type Pokemon. Fire-type Pokemon don't match up well against Rock-type Pokemon. Pokemon Trainer School. If I go to the school, will I be able to catch rare Pokemon easily? Not really, brother. Did you know this? You can have a two-on-two -two battle even if you're not with another trainer. If you catch the eyes of two trainers when you have two or more Pokemon, they'll both challenge you. Don't you think it'd be cool if you could beat two trainers by yourself? Not really. It's not fun. Especially in a Nuzlocke. The trainer school is excellent. If you study there, you can even become a gym leader. Roxanne, the gym leader, really knows a lot about Pokemon. She's really strong, too. Nothing. You people in this town have given me nothing. Oh, I already talked to you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever, you suck. A Pokemon you get in a trade from someone grows fast, but if you don't have a certain gym badges, it may not obey you. Uh-huh. Have you taken the Pokemon Gym Challenge? When you get that shiny gym badge in your hand, I guess the trainer begins to realize what it, it is required of them. Huh? My Pokemon is cute. Sure, I knew that. But if you really want, but if you really want, I'm willing to trade it to you. I'll trade you my Slugma for a Rolt if you want it. Huh. Oh, if you don't want to, that's okay. But my Pokemon is cute, you know? In all sorts of places, there are all sorts of Pokemon and people. I find that fascinating, so I go to all sorts of places. Yep. I hope there's an encounter I can get. I hope I'm not locked into this town until I get the gym badge. The Devon Corporation, we all just shortened it to Devon. That company makes all sorts of convenient products. Can I get encounters? Yes. 116. And... 115? I don't think there's encounters on 115. There's an item, though. I'm gonna get that item. Pokey doll. Okay. So I can get a Route 116 encounter. What do you have to say? 
Exploring a cave isn't like walking on a road. You never know when wild Pokemon will appear. It's full of suspense. Okay. So we can get a Route 116 encounter to make up for our lost Pokemon that we lost. Let's see what we get. Please be something not overpowered. Okay, okay. Hey, Mareep! Mareeps are fucking good, dude. Okay. So we are going to... Tackle. Fuck. Tackle shouldn't kill. Damn it. Try to get you? Try to capture you. Use a Pokeball. I don't want to waste my Great Ball or something on a Marine. Aw, oh, damn. Come on. Perfect! Thank you. I love Marie. Marie, the wool Pokemon. It's fully wool. It's fully wool rubs together and builds a static charge. The more energy is charged, the more brightly the light bulb at the tip of it still glows. Let's nickname you. Um. Let's see. Since you're so bright, I will name you... I'm gonna name you Sora from Kingdom Hearts, because he was pretty, pretty electric. He was a very light being. Okay. We are going to get the fuck out of here and heal up, because I'm not going through that paralyzed. I don't want to waste my medicine just yet, either. We have a new member. <laughs> we can take a look at their stats real fast. Okay. Sora, or Mareep. Electric type Pokemon with static ability. It's pretty good for physical people that attack it. Attack when growl. Okay. Probably gonna have to do a training montage to get, to get Sora caught up. Let's take a look at the Pokemon. Let's sell some of this random shit we have. Oh yeah, I'm selling Octazuka. Fuck that. Don't need that. Need, need that lame ass move. Hold on, boost experience. Lucky Egg is good. I'm not gonna get rid of that. Blue Scarf can go. Don't need Dire Hit. Poké Doll is good. Okay. Now, let's buy... Some Pokéballs. We'll buy... We'll have... We'll take 15 total. And then we'll buy some cushions. Buy another potion. Since we ballin' right now. Okay. My Pokemon, my Pokemon evolved. It has a lot of HP now. I should buy super potions for it instead of ordinary potions. I'm buying some paralyzed seals and antidotes, just in case I run into Shroomish in Petalburg Woods. I'm getting an escape rope, just in case I need to get, just in case I get lost in the cave. I just need to use it to get back to the entrance. Man, a lot happened. We lost our first member. That shit sucks. But we got a new member now. 
named Sora the Marie. With that being said, I think I'll end the episode here. The video's getting kind of long. If you like what you saw, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, peace.